third morning year one and welcome to our third geography lesson on hot and cold places today we're going to think about what it's like to live in these hot and cold places and we're going to have a think about how people adapt to living there so we've got two videos first one deals with cold places and focuses on a particular group of people who live in the arctic and the second video looks at hot places in general but there is a section that deals with the Bedouin, who are people who live in desert places. Okay, so here we go. So what you need to do is watch this first video, and then I want you to tell your grown-up what you think it would be like to live in a cold place like this. And once you've done that, start the video again, and watch this video now this video is actually intended for older children but there's a lot here that you'll understand and we're particularly interested in the section about the bedouin which explains what it's like and how they adapt to live in a hot place and also a lot of the other stuff will help you later when we're looking at how animals adapt okay so those are the two videos and then the task is pretty simple today now these two pictures have been printed and they're also available on teams so that in class the children are going to be describing the pictures and then they're going to have a go at coloring them in with the correct colors that go with these pictures and then writing underneath them now if you want to do the same you can print them from teams or alternatively, you could have a go at drawing the pictures and then writing about them, or you could just write about them. It's completely up to you. And that is the end of today's work. But there is a plenary to finish with. And that looks like this. So there is a final video to watch. So if you were to watch this video, tell your grown up whether or not you think you could be an Antarctic scientist, because that is probably the hardest, most challenging place to live on Earth. OK, so that is the end of today's learning.